Here's our U.S. Oh, team. Yeah, All right. For a brief. Everybody gather around. All right. It's, goddamn it's goddamn brief, brief time. Your, com your commander's a bit of a dyspraxic. If, has anyone got a medi kit? I think I hurt. Thank you. Gotcha. Oh, you big dummies. Is that that ankle that you hurt on the way here? Yeah. Uh, Alright, cool. Some guys are coming in. Excellent. Great. Right. Groovy. Great. Right. Okay, Here's Blackbeard's so brief for US. Uh, I kind of messed up, and uh, I was supposed to pick up my grandma uh, from uh, her knitting class, uh, and so... Uh, she decided she needs to take a lot of her friends with her. Um, so that's what we're doing, basically. We're uh, we're taking knitting supplies from here to the daycare center, which is in the Charlie 917 area. Um, and this is uh, this is U.S. military grade wool. Okay, this is some good shit. Not only that cheap shit. I love my grandma. All right, it's pretty simple. Oh my god. Uh, Nuclear Twister is going to be responsible for the uh, wool on these uh, on these hit trucks. Uh, and he's going to have some uh, heavy ordnance in the shape of some MRAPs to defend them. Uh, and he's going to be driving up. Now, as I understand it, there are some youths, okay, some hoodlums, who are looking to uh, prevent us from Duh. getting... Uh, exactly. My will to my grandma, all right? So what we're going to do instead uh, is we're going to roll in with some, uh, yeah, some heavy guns. Uh, and we're going to try and... Um, yeah, we're going to have Nuclear drive his convoy in. Uh, we're going to have Hawk provide security on the cliffs on the west side of the road we're taking this nice like coast coast road all right um the the um sorry about that admin stuff right um the yeah hawk squad is going to sort of defend the back of the convoy and the front of the convoy a fire team at each uh as we move down here Expert's going to be on the east side of the river, clearing out any sneaky hoodlums who try to get over the river with their RPGs. Uh, and then just generally give us another option in terms of, you know, if we take a firefight, then they can they can cover from the other side of the river. Anytime that we come across a roadblock, Nucleus is going to dismount all of his uh, drivers, and those drivers are going to try and take down that roadblock while his gunners and Hawk and Expert provide security. Ronin is going to walk into the desert like that scene in the original Judge Dredd. Uh, and he's going to go and find himself. He's going to split up his guys into two fire teams, provide OPs, give us a bit of screening, and just generally make sure that we don't get fucked up by uh, and prevent them like redeploying. It's kind of good. My nan really wants this wool, so I'd really appreciate it if you guys could, you know, bring home the win for this one. That would be great. Uh, any questions? Ask your squad leads. Uh, convoy guys, mount up now. Once they're mounted up, then uh, everyone else can get in. Good luck, boys. Good luck. Win this, boys. Let's do it! Oh, and we're live. We're live. So, you're going to be in the rear with the game for a bit. So we're waiting. U.S. are going to gather them, gather themselves here for a second, and then they're going to move out. We are live with round one of Operation Dark Trail. Uh, if you just joined us, this is a Squad Ops One Life event. One life, meaning you get one shot. Uh, do not lose yourself in the mo- okay, I tried the meme and it failed. Pretty standard there. The opportunity to set up a FOP comes one, once in a lifetime. Okay. We're gonna go with that. So they're gonna take this coastal road, they're gonna turn in towards oh, Desna. Yeah, we got infantry dismounting here. So these guys are going to be a screen force. Looks like a large number of the infantry are actually coming out here. So the convoy is basically going to be uh, mainly protected by the MRAPs. Instead of the MRAPs going running, running uh, wild in the the forest off the road, minimal presence for infantry in the convoy. While US forces are beginning their uh, organization of their convoy and having their infantry move out, let's take a look at militia positions. We already have a fortified off-site location here in a, uh, in a roadblock. This is the roadblock, two wooden barriers and they have one layer of barbed wire here 
And on the rocks directly above, this is going to be a uh, a limited. Oh, look at this. They already have a PKP here, too. That's a medium machine gun. Um, the militia have two of. They've deployed one up here. And it looks like there is an engineer here. So let's look for mines real quick. Oh, yeah. They got a mine and an IED already planted. And there's mine number one. Right in the middle of the road. You can see it. So where's that first uh, roadblock at? Is it right if you're unfamiliar right? with squad ops rules, mines have to have the red cap visible at all times. Okay, yeah, and this IED is actually uh, off the side of the road. Let's see if I can find it real quick. Uh, is that it? No, let's see here. Okay, it's somewhere in front of me. Ah, oh, there it is. I think that's it. Is that it? No. Hmm, where is the ID? It's in front of me now. All right, four, continue your sweep west. Try and get me eyes it's on somewhere in this brush. Between your current direct west and southwest of your position. And that makes a lot of sense because it's the... It's probably one of the areas an infantry would probably be uh, set up in. Uh, try and set up in the to stage themselves before they run out in the open and start digging up this... Uh, this roadblock. One of the lodges here. There's a radio that's simply existing for the sake of creating the stuff. This is an interesting position this uh, MMG has taken. Magic. We got a squad lead here. This is Dorf. He's got eyes on the road, doing nothing but reporting position. Groot's here. Silence got himself. An AR. He's got an M249. Is that an M249? That's something. He's got a. He's got an AR pointed in the forest here. This is going to be pretty good if he can get eyes on the ridge line and he can spot infantry coming in that's good that's uh that's gonna be a good time for silent here and a cardi is doing some sightseeing i don't think so neat all right seven op continue to observe do you see anything on the west side of the river there's speaking of things on the west side of the river yeah, nothing in the cliffs, no, no movement. It looks like they're setting up in the east. An side. entire squad here. Okay, copy. So, militia, I guess, have thought of everything for this yeah, first. Yeah, they've they've deployed just, two squads to this first uh, roadblock. Right. Um, three, send, a, send your rear and wrap back up across the river and back up squad four. Four, engage in the Looks like they have a lat. Uh, I, th I want to say they have a lat here. Four, Let me double check and gonna, see if they uh, actually have a lat. Hmm. Mighty is the squad leader in charge of this element. Looks like no lat. So this is going to be a purely anti-infantry play. This position here. And they're going to be coming into contact soon. I bet you e -Fank just saw him. He switched out to his gun. He's got an MMG too. Oh, look at this position. He's able to deploy it on the cliffside right here, so he's looking for targets. He might have seen Bacon Batman. Maybe but these guys aren't being um, aren't being inconspicuous right now, but I think and Devious is actually set up here too. Devious firing in. Devious is dead. Bagum Batman is dead. That was horrible. Firing into a militia prepared position with not the best position themselves. Two down for US already. 
this uh, side support squad for U.S. gonna have some problems if they want to push in. They gotta find another way to get to this position. Expect these guys to move further east before coming around. And, uh, yeah, Devious and the other guy, oh, and they're falling back! Militia are falling back, so I guess they got some confirmed hits, and, uh, they wanna, they're gonna fight another day, so... The shoot and screw tactics also working at the infantry squad level. Three, can you move your, uh, your Crows MRAP further south? Uh, keep moving it south. I imagine they're going to try and break contact. Four, pursue contact. Three, if you can head south. Squad in the west going to give chase. Sure One squad closer to the road. Uh, let's take a look at where these guys are. That yeah, the on the move. Golf 11, six -ish. Let's take a look at some other... Golf 11, six, golf and here's the rest of the militia team right here. Uh, Centered around a roadblock in Desna, uh, no doubt. So this is going to be... I would have thought they would have tried to defend further up the road here. But I guess not. If you have to advance in order to do so, then by all means move an MRAP up. Copy. We have one here, gents. Try not to peak that, uh, the curve in the road, by the way. US force is getting closer to the initial roadblock. Looks like, uh... Fire team worth of folks seared. Doobie Scoo, they were just running out there in the open. Frederick and Dick's folk. Also part of this fire team. Pushing ever closer. Looking at Uncle Niner, who's got himself a dishka. And all he's doing is watching the road. You can see the initial roadblock here in the distance. There's a bit of fog at distance here, so long-range uh, engagements are going to be a little bit more hindered than usual. It's not a, exactly a clear day. And Dark Milkshake, one of the two lats for Militia here. That AT is going to be important if Militia are going to get some real kills on some... M raps here. Three has negative on. Three, have your have have that sorry, I don't want to micro this, but have that um M rap head way down on the southern road. Dorf still has his eyes out and he's still looking at the road for the most part, but he's picking up his scan a little bit. I wonder if the squad to the west oh Fox eleven nine. Was that a no, that wasn't a shot. Fox eleven nine six. Zanky is redeploying himself here to try to get on top of this rocks. I think Dorf maybe. Chances are they're probably I think. I wonder if Dorf has seen these guys on top of the hill. You can sweep up and the Gulf US are getting a lot closer now. If it's not being covered from there, it will be being covered from. Within about 200 meters. Fox 11 8. Uh, 8 3, those cliffs there. Or maybe further down towards the Fox 11 8 3. Uh, Fox 12 8 3. But those are going to give the best sight lines of that rope. And shots being taken now by Dorf. MMG having to under, having to not use the bipod to get shots on this infantry up here on the top of the uh, rock, on top of the hill. Dix is trying to find himself a better position to shoot from? Question mark. So this first, uh, this first roadblock okay, so about ready to come under fire by infantry. Right, you need to move towards, down this river, down this, like, creek bed or whatever you're in. Uh, get to the Echo 922 area. Then from there, head south and... My graphic settings. With one. Okay. 
What would you mean in chat? Three, you can slow roll the rest of your convoy up behind the MRAP. Three. Let me scoot some audio down real quick. Alright, command. The roadblock is at Fox 1195 area, and we have infantry at Fox 1183 ro uh, rock formation. Yeah, copy that. It's those rocks. Yeah. And uh, okay, just try the infantry called out just about a, just a fire team's worth. I'm sorry, can you repeat last? Hold position, don't peek. Two's moving to flank and engage the target. Understood. Three, what Two moving to flank. Engaged the what? No. Two so far off. We're gonna be waiting for another four minutes or so for two to get over here. Okay, copy that. Uh, tell him to tell him to. Push, Expert uh, needs to get his squad in position to provide some to provide some covering fire here. And two is actually gonna run into a fire team. That's not good. I want to take a look at this position real quick. This is Jackal 800 with uh, Niels, Kuba, and Lad. Have themselves a little... Uh-oh. I move away and there's more firing going on. Let's go back. I mean, my graphics... Which one? Okay. Oh no, Liberal's dead. Liberal just bleed out. And one losing two there. This is a turning? Uh, no, this is a one life event. So this is a regularly scheduled game that we have. We have three of these typically in a week. This is three that Southern Airman has eyes on a lodgy. Wait one for Grip. And one life events, meaning uh, this is a one life operation. Once you become unconscious, you have to give up. Great graphics. I don't know what you're talking about. I just try, I'm just trying to, to run this. Groot adding some fire. Ooh, Groot got hit. Zaki, the MMG. It looks like Frederick's finally found himself a decent firing position here at the top of the hill. Code Brown, if you're interested in joining our group and playing, um, you won't be able to join today unless you have basic. We, um, all the players that come into squad ops take a basic SOTT course, and that's just a expectations course that tells you guys what's going on. Gets everyone on the same page, so that everyone can enjoy these events together. Squadops.gg is where you want to go. I'm a fire team down. Oh, Ronan got destroyed here on the edge. Karma now over here with the uh, with this science security team. This position was really good. There's a bunch of wounded over here, too. Let's take a look from the militia perspective. You see Karma with his Binox out. Another person just goes down. Ronan's dead. So that's a squad leader dead for this squad to try to come over. U.S. Plenty of casualties, and it looks like Slev just uh, bled out. I know he may be in a he may have been a spectator. Scrubby's Maximus running away. Bartok throwing smokes. Who's in charge of this element now? Jericho's a fire team leader, so I imagine he's going to be promoted here soon, unless someone else is. Vince running away. He might be uh he might be next in line here. Command, this is, uh, 
Do you mean the real Karma Cut? Yes, the real Karma Cut is here. Right now he's on Militia, which is red. US team in blue. And all the comms you're going to be hearing this round are in blue. MRAPs have uh, come off road finally to try to support. This is the this is the Crow's MRAP. U.S. taking their time to, uh, U.S. are taking their time to try to get any sort of momentum here. They gotta work a little bit harder at pushing into this first point. Although, all of the militia in the area have their, are probably getting eyes on this first roadblock. Groot able to shoot in here. Or actually, Groot got hit by Silas, maybe. This is what it looks like from the US perspective. Zaki's got himself a nice rock to hide behind, as well as Groot in the defilade side of that hill. US forces, the squad in the west is now find themselves a nice overwatch position. And the first MRAP is now creeping forward. This scenario plays without FOB mechanics. Yeah, so this is a... There's all the operations that we have have specific rules and specific plans. Or objectives, rather. So this isn't... We're not playing the map. Like, if you look at the map, we're not playing these objectives. The objective for Operation Dark Trail is that this convoy has to make it all the way along this road to reach this position in Bravo 9-6, where they're going to set up a, a uh, FOB. And depending on how many resources they have once the convoy reaches the end, is how many resources they'll have to play with to build their uh, last stand FOB. Right now, there are two roadblocks and the MRAP is starting to... The MRAP's taking some shots from the Dishka. Taking a lot of shots from the Dishka here. Uncle Niner has the Dishka really... Look at that. All you can see is the turret. The MRAP now returning fire. That's Mankeys in the MRAP gunner. And Uncle Niner just killed Mankeys. Uh oh. And a tire popped. Oh, and. The MRAP. Wow, the Dishka penetrated the MRAP's. Uh... Wow. Postscriptive event still a thing? Oh yeah, my dude. We had one last night. We're having one again on Sunday. And that's actually open to the public. If you guys are interested in participating in that event, check our calendar at squadops.gg. You don't have to have basic to participate. Anyone's welcome, as long as they have postscriptum. Times are always going to be in your local time zone on the calendar, so use that as a reference. With this MRAP dead in the water, with its wheels destroyed too, the Dishka is going to just throw some more rounds into this thing to try to get it completely disabled. Meanwhile, US forces starting to push up in this prepared position. Looks like plenty of uh, militia have died here. Groot looks like to be the last one holding this position close. Watch your exposure to the south hill, though, they got MG emplacements up there. Same thing on our southwest. That's ammo, bet. That's squadops.gg is the URL. Yep, sure they left. Yep, contact. Southwest, southwest. Right here. SKS, right here. Yeah, go command. 
Here it comes a frag. That's gonna be overthrown. Oh, it's not. It bounced. Wow. Okay. So the frag bounced off the rock and landed right in front of Groot. But there might be more. And Dark Milkshake got gets called out. A lot comes in. Frag rocket. Great spacing here by US. And a miss by the um, lap means that Frederick has a little bit of a chance here to throw some rounds out. Some suppression going on. But Frederick now taking rounds. He has to hide in the rocks here. Wait, Akardi and Silent are still here. They're just hiding. Akardi got hit. And I think Seared has his number, so if Akardi peeks out after he stabilizes, he might be dead. Oh, Seared actually backs up a little bit. He's trying to get a better position. And Akardi trying to throw some rounds in. Ooh, gets Seared in the face! U.S. forces not doing too well. About 15 minutes of the operation. Um, U.S. have three kills. Militia have 16. That's got to hurt. I think Silas is also... Stuck in, he's not stuck in the rocks, but... He's definitely covered over here. Let's take a look at this militia position to see how some shifting is going on. Medical is just looking... He's looking for targets to engage right now. Frederick and Silas. Frederick dies to uh, a Cardian Silent over there. Who I thought had moved off the hill, but um, just found themselves a different uh, position here. This is rough. Rough for U.S. right now. U.S. force is about half down their manpower. And they are moving up the convoy very slowly. I think they're trying to get this... Um, I think they're trying to reclaim this M-Ramp, but the M-Ramp has a busted tire. It's not going to be very useful. The Crow's M-Ramp... Not doing anything in the north side of the militia defense here. Everyone is still up. And two is reorganizing for another attack from a different direction. This four squad here from Expit is on the west side of the river. I'm not sure what this plan is. I, I guess the plan is for four to come across and support, but... Militia already have this in mind. This is the squad that uh, Expert uh, that Blue Four, Red Four was engaging Blue Four earlier, and they just fallen back to cover the river uh, approach. I imagine right here the river is shallow enough to cross on foot. Oh no, the Dishka. Dishka, looks like another one dead there. Looks like that's linked dead. Blue, uh, US don't have mortars yet. They gotta put the fob down. So they gotta get to the end of the convoy to put the fob down. The end of the route over in Bravo 9-6. So... The real trump card for US here are supposed to be these MRAPs. The convoy reversing up so they're going to try to get the convoy in a safer position they've remanned the um MRAPs here yeah, this second MRAP doesn't even have a uh the second MRAP doesn't even have a gunner This is, this is rough. They got The whole point of this operation is that militia have set up roadblocks 
the convoy can't leave the road, so they have to dismantle these roadblocks. The militia position is elevated. They have multiple. They have multiple lines on this. Uh, roadblock here and the MRAP has found a uh, there we go finally oddball and squid were here in the crow's MRAP run into a tree I think they're getting recalled storm and uh, who is this venom's Oops, a little bit too fast on the camera speed there. Reloading. Taking some shots here Take from it. far. Tracers do work both ways. Storm and Venom running away. Bad news for U.S. They gotta reorganize here to at least try to push this first roadblock, which is still up. There's no way they're gonna be able to clear it because there's an, a fire team plus just hanging out on this hillside. Oh, I heard something go pop at a distance here. The MRAP got hit. MRAP hit twice. And it's on fire, it's gonna pop here, so... I think that spells... I think that's it for the, uh, Crow's MRAP here. Uncle Niner just adding some fire at the last second. This is three, we're down to one MRAP, one lodge. So we've lost two lodges. We have two lodges sitting on the road that are not being used. Right. U.S. forces... Okay. Have pulled back. And looks like there's going to be a change of plans here for U.S. forces. Can't say that I. I don't agree. I don't uh, disagree, rather, with the uh, plan right now to reconsolidate. U.S. have got to figure out what they want to do now, and I think it's going to be using the MRAP that they have remaining. And just, they're going to slow walk it up, I guess. I mean, I don't know what else they can do. There's really not much else they can do. Yeah, Steel, you're just looking at what I'm set at, or is there improvements I can make? Or you just want to know what I'm using? The militia force is still holding. This is the second roadblock here. Wood walls and barbed wire. Militia forces just chilling in this village. Actually, looks like there might be a there might be a push out here coming from the forces in the village. That would be oof. Have we ta we've taken have we taken down one of the uh, roadblocks? That's a negative. So we haven't taken down a single roadblock. We have eyes on first roadblock, but that's it. Okay. All right. I'll be honest, lads. Um, it's not looking good. Things have not necessarily developed in our favor. U.S. forces reconvening here. Let's take a look and see what's going on. And I think U.S. have just decided they want to ditch the MRAP. So they're just going to be pure infantry clearing out 
the first um so uh the first roadblock i suppose new plan. grandma doesn't need the wool so uh instead we're just gonna go and kill a load of people uh and then if we manage to get through at least one of these fucking roadblocks then we'll bring the convoy forward uh but as it stands we have just over a squad left uh, Bartok, you'll roll with me. Send yeah. Uh, three, you take the rest of your dudes. You act as our west flank. Uh, four, you stay close to the river in the uh, in the hills. We're just gonna fucking platoon line it down, find the contact, engage them, kill them, and then hopefully get something out of this shit. Because I'll be honest, uh, it's looking pretty bleak. Everyone cool with that? Sounds good. Yeah, I mean, I have to be. All right. Bartok and Silas on me will sit in the rear. Uh, three and four lead us out. Really? Line ahead of us. Really? Oh. Really? Okay. He's heading southwest. All right. U.S. reconsolidated. They're going to move. Blackbeard and expert relay those contact reports. Yeah. They're going to move out. U.S. Our militia actually haven't reinforced this first position. It's maybe medical. Kumquat. What a name. Uh, Manacle and Kumquat have actually moved over here from the hillside. And that's it. Manacle admiring the riverside view he has here. Oh, the squad leader over here is actually dead. So it's just a Cardi. Silent is actually kind of up here by himself. I think he may have just been... Expit's dead. Oof. And the uh, Dishka opening up again. How far is this Dishka throwing rounds? And the lat is now shooting at over 300 meters. Music and uh, his squad lead here are now putting some fire into the village. Heads up on the enemy that was close to us. I don't know if he's yep, down. Yep, shift right, uh, 220, there's some sandbags. Reloading, yeah, I'm reloading. Yeah, watching down the hill. Ooh, is Patrick Star in these sandbags? Oh, great. More sandbags. Yeah. yeah. Keep doing it. Keep doing it. Yeah, this is this is a shit. Ooh, take. Silas is just chilling here. I think he wants to try to. He's gonna try to get this rock between him and the enemy. Silent eats a grenade. Smart thinking by US forces there to throw the grenade over. They got lucky with the throw. With Silent dead, that means they can push a little bit more further forward here. They still have three people on this hill to clear. And Akardi's doing nothing but looking right now. Which could be bad for him. If he doesn't see... I guess he's expecting the US to... Well, he might be expecting the U.S. to move directly where he's looking right now. Fight milk in the open with Salty Potato close behind. And I think Akardi just spotted him. Yeah, Akardi's switching to a rifle. And he wants to take a shot on Fight Milk, I think. Blackbeard, U.S. Command now leading... Leading the infantry push here. Salted Potato gets killed by Akardi. Or, I say he gets killed by Akardi, but he actually... Yeah, he bled out there. Rocket's coming in. Uh-oh. U.S. forces falling back. Trying to get some... better. Trying to get a better position to engage militia at. 
Sly Steven eats a rocket. Cover can't help you forever. And music and, uh, looks like some folks are gonna hit this tree line here. Brent's found someone to shoot. Kuba knee holes fall back. Jack is on this ridge line. And Bartok with the uh, Carl Gustav. Let's, uh, move that hill. Bing! Modern death is dead. All right, I'm in cover. I'm in cover. Muff runs away. Or no, Should Muff looks like he, he's got a lat. He's got a frag rocket. Just over the uh, these guys' position here. I don't come for cards of fruit. I know that could be like 20 million different things, but I mean, come on. Militia have a pretty, pretty superior position here. All right, let's go die. Bartok's rocket overshoots the ridge line, I think. The remaining US forces are now in the north here, trying to screen west as far as they can. Trident gets gunned down in the field. Bartok and Grunt in full sprint trying to make it there. Music is just crawling along. Neholes and Cuba are going to make a attempt to try to stop these guys peeking over the ridge line. Neholes doesn't know that uh, Bartok and Grunt have made it this far. And Bartok kills Neholes. Cuba. One eight eight. I just opened my map. <laughs> if you have nature, over this Koopa falling back. Way. Now Jack is uh, also falling back here. Hey Grunt, throw a, throw a nade if you have one. I don't, I don't They're gonna fall back to that wall, and that's gonna be bad news of U.S. trying to push that into there. At this point, U.S. forces are trying to make some sort of impact in the area. One life operations typically don't end until everyone on one team is dead. And I say typically, uh, take typically to mean almost close, always. Can, uh, yeah, the grenade. I think they moved away from it. Silas and Venom. Be. The last two over here. Oh, they're making a play for the roadblock. The distraction play comes into its own. They're still medical up here on the ridge line and Kumquat, and I think Akardi's over here too. Silas taking very, very measured approach here is actually pushed past. I wonder if Matical will be starting yeah, to up hear. Here. They're up here. Silas definitely heard a Matical crawl around, There's so. If you get a nade through it, I'm going to sweep around the low ground. No, I don't have a nade. And okay, no frags. Rocks, so let's be careful. No, hold on. Meanwhile, uh, Bartok and Grunt and Music push into Jack and Koopa on the wall here. They decide, nope. They're gonna get a. They're gonna pivot around and find a better location. We're just gonna get cornered if we go there. Oh, oh no. Uh, Jack might have seen these guys. Bartok definitely saw Jack. Try to take a few shots. Hey, I'm done. And Kuba's dead. So maybe they didn't see Jack, they just saw Kuba. Kuba had a position Stay right around here. All time. Jack is falling back to the village. Uh, okay, let's so see what go what's going on over here. Venom just died, and I think Silas is dead, too. Silas got gunned down on the road. U.S. down to three. Making the last push to try to... at least get some forward momentum here. Uh, 32 kills for Mill. Nine kills for U.S. Try to see if you can see anyone. Anyone have binos? Use them. I don't know. Music, uh, I, I wonder if that was... Uh, 210, he's running to our left now. Oh, Music hit Jack. Jack caught a bit of a bullet, but he's gonna be fine. 
He's got more than half his health. I generally have no plan to what the fuck to do. Okay, we can... The house right in front of you, 10. And Jack... Oh, it looks like Bartok saw Fulcrum peeking out at him. Fulcrum's in that okay. house with Nova. Meanwhile... I'm sorry, guys. Patrick Star and Evan... Patrick Star's got himself a position on top of this hill. Ooh, a rocket came in. Did that get anyone? Runt's dead. And Bartok's dead, so it's just music and music eats another rocket there too. So I think that's it. Just waiting here for a GD to, GG to come from Evans. But that's round one. There we go. Round one, a very convincing defense from Militia. 35 kills to US 9. US not getting past the first roadblock in the grand scheme of things. Oof. That's rough. I just realized I had a dog in my room. Dubs, you want to say hi to the stream? Dubs, you want to say hi to the stream? Uh, guess what? We're live. Oh, the transport. That's the transport. Um, and we have dismount of infantry at the intersection. Pretty much the same as before. Someone gets run over by a lodgy. And command is driving a lodgy. Let's take a look at the front of the convoy. MRAPs can move off-road, so, you know, um, that's a thing. Crows, with its uh, optics upgrade, are extremely important. We're spotting targets at range. Oh, look at this. Wow, so the Dishkateki and two motorbikes, so that's a whole screen. This is a whole squad right here. Whole screen. A whole squad are moving north. They're gonna attack the element from behind. That's super interesting. I wondered how, um, I wondered how Black Rear was gonna play this as militia. And they're gonna use the same roadblock area U.S. infantry moving out. They're going to sweep ahead. It'll be interesting to see how close the MRAPs keep this time. The hell was that? That was a weird noise. We're going to move down here. This is the big first corner that the convoy is going to take. And from here, it looks like there are plenty of INS positions that we can see. Pretty much the same setup. About a squad's worth of folks at the first... ...hill, but no roadblock. The first roadblock is here. In a nice visible mine. I hear tires. Is that a glitch near me? That's us. That's what I was talking about. Might be a sound bug or something. It's a sound bug with the emerald. 
Nuclear Twister's got a fire team moving out. Um, they're going to take the hill that U.S. engaged them from last round. And the uh, convoy is actually coming into a kill zone here. Now, militia aren't prepared. They're just getting to this position. So I imagine they're going to be spotted here in short order. Oddball throws a uh, AR up on a rock side, on part of this rock side here. Ooh, and an MRAP is crawling forward. If Oddball gets a nice little grouping, he can knock out the gunner for the uh, open top in short order. I've, we've got contact 255 on the rocks. But these guys have been called out by uh, squad lead. Side of the river? Karma cut? No, 255, opposite side, top of the rock. Alright, start shooting once you get a good shot. And I expect to see... Oh, look at this. Karma's called it from here. Karma's got his guys all laid out on this opposite ridge line. They're going to put some fire in here. And some militia are going to die. Mighty, watch out. Get your guys up on those rocks. And if yeah, Nuclear okay. Twister dies, that's a yeah, squad lead down that, for militia really early on. Heard a grid call out. G104. That's an accurate grid call out from Karma. Look at the spacing here. They're not. I am maneuvering the crows. Alright, Mighty took a casualty. Get your guys in cover. Get them Oh, music and oddball are dead. And Lawn's dead too. So trading two for one, not a good thing early on, and Karma's team now opens up. Salty Potato, did Nuclear make it out? Nuclear is still alive, so two down and one blow there for US, or for Militia rather, and Squidward gonna, it's, there's too much fire. Squidward gonna head out of there. Salty Potato is sort of stuck here. And Militia going to hightail it out of there. So that's a great first engagement for US. Maybe a sign of things to come? We don't know. Obviously, that wasn't a prepared position by uh, INS there, or for Militia there. And Militia falling back, not unexpected. However, this is sort of nuts. The... Dishkateki is north of infantry pushing around. Expit has a fire team in a. This is the. Uh, command, man, this is, uh, this is the busted the fortress. Like they're egressing westbound off the rock over. Right. In Keep central Gordok. Mighty, this is your chance. To this go. is a little bunker. This is the busted southern part of that fortification. They might have eyes on two moving across if they were looking. They might have eyes on. And I bet you soon we might hear a contact of, we might hear a report of vehicle movement. Let's take a look at this position here while U.S. slowly inch forward along the road. I have no eyes on contact west. No shot, no shot. Over. All right, keep going south then. Sloth is continuously trying to push to his south west while INS forces in the compound, I guess they don't really have eyes from here. Expit on the ridge line. Grid is Fox 11, 5, 9, at least one fire team over. Copy that. Right where Dorf was last round. Box 11, yep, so that's Mankey's Linked and Fight Milk with Dark Lord somewhere lurking in the back. So, this is a unfortified position for Militia, yep. and Karma's already called this out, so 
that could be bad. And it looks like Karma's gonna go ahead and throw a, uh... Eyes on buildings at Foxtrot 1065. Uh, no contacts in sight. For three. He's gonna go ahead and throw some guys on a ridge line here, and I think he's gonna throw a bunch of lead this way in a second. You can see... Modern Death Lad... Lurking around. We're gonna go ahead and take this position to see what they can see from this distance. We have a distant north of my Delta team. Oh, no, hold on. So you got the technical flanking around. Yeah, we have the technical flanking around. I see, uh... The Dishka great, great. is opening up. Got contact to your front, ready for grit. Dishka rolling. Mighty, mighty, I got contact report. Stand by for... Break, uh, fucking technical retreating. Uh, going, uh, and infantry are now opening up on these guys. Part of Slot's squad got stuck in the open in the rocks here. The goon and demon Einstein are stuck open. Looks like Grunt had eyes on. What was that? IED. Looks like casualties from this IED. One U.S. casualty from the IED that was on the position. Whoa. So the Dishka is still adding some fire here now. And it looks like Demon Einstein and the Goon were able to maneuver a little bit. Viper almost getting destroyed. Dishka going back and forth here. And it looks like we got some uh, shooting going on over here. Zanky90 and Groot have pushed an MRAP forward. And Karma's got his squad in the east. So Karma's here, he's passing uh, Soloniki. And there's a squad with two MRAPs forward. Command and a small element are back with the convoy itself. What is that? Oh, they bypassed a mine, I guess. Uh Fire team gonna be pushing the back side. They got a lat? Yeah, they got a lat. Alright, now we're waiting for Mighty to clear that rock. You can't Dark milkshake with the, uh. Alright. With the crows here. Alright. You see anything directly south of Mighty close? How do you get on the squad up server? You take our basic course, and then you're able to sign up for operations. Once you sign up for an operation, you just show up for roll call, and that's how you get in. That is to say, this is a closed event. Everyone that is here has participated in our basic SOTT. And with that, they're able to sign up for all of our operations. Is that, is that uh, sandbags? Enemy Sandbag, where, where? Uh, 240 maybe, just check it out. Zaki may have spotted someone crawling along up top here. Now this location has been called out, but I wonder if the information trickled back down to the MRAPs. These guys have a pretty good position, and they have, ele they have an element of infantry now pushing. Matter of fact, these guys are taking some shots. They're shooting at Nuclear Twister and a fire team that was there. Sorry, two, four, five. Two, four, Ooh. Five on top of that hill, yep. Right where those rocks are. We pushed those guys up the Pushing left. Okay, we got, we got guys um, at 
the rocks to our west southwest 240 from us and they're falling back i'm gonna try to reel back in towards the rocks but they're definitely there inland all right do you need mrap support for that might do another soon uh, yeah, yeah man we run them three times a week at least Maybe we'll sometimes more when it's a holiday or something like that it's coming up you can check our That's calendar at for all yeah. the times we have uh, operations yeah, scheduled. Usually we run them on Wednesday evenings, and um, we run them twice on Saturdays. So this is the first of two operations we'll run today. We run one a little bit earlier in the afternoon, one a little bit uh, later in the evening. I think the last position we stay is Fox 11. Yeah, yeah, Fox 11, so, yeah, Nuclear know. Squad is pushed back to the rocks. This was the rock where the ro the roadblock was last round. This is a pretty good position to hold early on. Let's take a look and see if there's any other movement. This fire team has actually gotten a lot closer. Let's take a look at this real quick. This fire team could really cause some problems because the convoy is just holding position here I don't doubt it. And reorienting, um, to the south so that we can get better eyes up. If they kill command, as far as I can tell, that could be bad news. Has These guys okay, no are starting spot. to maybe get a bit closer. I wonder if Evan will spot these guys. He's looking south, and Bacon okay. Batman visible there. Evan is simply coordinating his guys right now. So I wonder if he's even looking. He might have the map open. Karma is here. He's playing around today. Evan's still on his, uh... Still talking. And it looks like these guys might be trying to get around. Are they gonna... I wonder what these guys are doing. These guys would be real sneaky. And Triton has the lat. I think they're just looking around. Something tells me they're going to wait for a little bit more of a cue. And looks like Slot Squad just ran into a fire team that's protecting a hill. Viper and Imanaz under some real stressful fire here. They're using this ditch to maneuver. Not an NSA spy has himself a tree he's posted off of. And it looks like they're able to stop Slot's uh, squad from pushing up. There's a fire team against a fire team right now. So far, no casualties from this action, but lots of bullets clear? flying around. Imanaz taking some shots at uh, Vince. Maybe one casually now. Yeah, I agree. The question is, how do we get the hell back? We can just go back. I think we're fine. Yeah, start pulling back. You two start pulling back. Viper trying to get his fire team back. Imanaz throwing some more rounds down. Just because. We're going to go back to the convoy section. We're going to see. Oh, these guys are holding position. They're starting to move. I wonder if Triton is... Another IED goes off. Triton's now loaded AT. Evan is in the back vehicle. This is not good. A shot goes off and it, it hits over. And here we go. Here comes the scrambling AT shots. Evan gets out. Triton's going to reload a rocket. He's going to take another shot here. Evan's going to move a vehicle. Is Triton, let's see what Triton's next shot is. An overshot! And Triton gets destroyed. By the MRAP. Silent and Kumquat. Kill the element of that flanking squad, so these guys are completely useless now and they're falling back. 
Matter of fact, their Dishka is coming back too. They have a Dishka Techie, Storm and Revy have it. And Storm is engaging. What is he shooting at? Evan gets out of the vehicle just in time as his gets destroyed. Zanke and Groot come back. They're looking for the technical. Evan's actually gotten into the second technical, or seven, the second uh, Lodgy there. And Storm and Revy in the technical, they're going to reposition. They got to be real careful here because... MRAPs are both coming back to try to block off the northern approach here. They're going to have to be careful. They've, there's a mine still in the road, but the MRAP... Two MRAPs now focusing on the road to their north. They're going to have to be super careful. Some shots coming. This fire team. Xbit's been hit with the gunner of the MRAP dead, or the, uh, the technical dead. These guys are going to have to reposition here, and look at this fire superiority being put out by U.S. right now. That's bad news. The convoy is still halted, but without that lat, the only thing that can really effectively engage the Lodges here are the dish, is the Dishkateki. And with those MRAPs there, you basically call that out. Meanwhile, some progress very actually a little bit of progress being made karma's squad in the east have moved south carl gustav actually throwing some frag rocket i think there uh russian or militia positions not really been affected so a lot of shooting going on but not a lot of hitting things Eight kills for U.S., two kills for Mill. Oh. I was going to say, I thought there was some more right there, but... I've never seen so many fucking shells so badly. Half 11. There's a U.S. force on the next ridge line. Up. I don't know, man. I put that right up for fucking tailpipe, though. That's far. That's real far. No, there shouldn't. Slot, they're on the rocks at Golf 988. Oh, looks like these guys are falling back. Uh, that's low. over to our 162. Looks like an IED is planted on the top of the hill no, here. Maverick There's a mine in the road. Roger, good copy. Track. Go through the town and get around. The, the snap is, fire. but the actual fire straight is coming fire. from 250. Roger that, good copy. Taking a look at this fire team here. A little bit of a better position, although everyone's pulling back. Karma's actually engaging forces on the uh, ridge line opposite the river. Raptor force is hit. Lots of fire going out here. Doobie Scoo and Frederick under some pretty intense fire right here. From Jacko 800, Doobie looks like he might be. I think he's behind. There's a little. Uh, there's a little ditch that runs down that hill. I think that's what he's hiding in right now. Frederick may be a little bit more boned. All right, Mighty. I think you think. You think? Long on. Fox 11, 4, 3. Then we yeah, there's a there's a small hill that Frederick's hiding behind, but if he moves out of this defilade, he's going to be wide open. Frederick looked like he wants to deploy a little bit more offensively here. Which is my hesitation. Uh, this could not... This could... This could blow back on him. Though, there's really no one... There's really no one here looking at these guys. At least in this position. If Frederick can sneak himself up on top of this rock... Oh, Jack scooted forward a little bit. Now, Jack definitely has a better firing position on Frederick. You see, this is Karma squad position right here, firing onto this element right here. It looks like they're repositioning to stop a river crossing. 
karma. There's still, uh, you can't see them right now, but there's still infantry up here, and it looks like U.S. have sent a squad, or a fire team in at least, to try to hit them from the side. You heard earlier Evan say he wants these guys taken care of before anything else happens, and a fire team plus size element from Sloth is going to run into devious cookies, Sly, uh, Steven, and Bacon Batman here in a second. Even Oz leading the charge for this fire team. With Viper close in behind. And the goon. Along with Demon Einstein. They're gonna clear buildings here. Sly Steven is actually in the open here. I don't think he knows these guys are coming. Does Viper see him? Yep, Viper sees Devious and Sly Steven. They're just in the open. Oh, look at this. Imanas is gonna continue moving around. He's gonna deploy... If he, he's looking around for him. Devious and Sly Steven make it to a, right, some defilade. Northeast, Roger, looking. Yeah. You get in to help These guys look like they slip the right by. All right, fuck it, let's put. And Viper wants, Viper wants these two badly. Bacon Batman actually has a, he's crawling up to this rock formation right here. And he's looking around. Is he going to see anyone through these? Evan, those, uh, those Does he see? Back northeast of us. He sees the open top MRAP. He tries to take a shot at Silent. Right. And Silent Try to kill immediately him. pushes himself down in his turret. He doesn't see where the fire is coming from. I think he's going to take another shot at... Megan's going to take another shot at this. Oh, some rounds come in really close. Might have been the goon taking a shot okay, at the so Bacon Batman's back of his head. Even us and Viper pushing through, and some rounds crashing around Bacon Batman. Sly Steven Divas Cookie have now fall, all fallen back to this position. There's a lot of fire going on in the south, and that's U.S. forces pushing in. Oh, here comes the Dishka. That could be bad. I wonder what the Dishka's gonna set up. I think the Dishka's trying to chase these... No, the Dishka... Looks like it's running away. x bit and a Revy. They're gonna redeploy that Dishka somewhere else, I guess. So, for the meanwhile, it looks like... Oh, okay, so the... MRAP is now taking some shots at Sly and Bacon. Looks like blind suppression. And here comes some smook. I guess these guys are going to run straight at the convoy? Oh, one of the smoke grenades went off at them. They're going to be running straight into U.S. here at this uh, railway embankment. Devious died to the MRAP, I believe. With Bacon and Sly popping smokes, Dorf is going to come right up in here. And Bacon and Sly aren't even going to see anything. I, I wonder how they can see anything right now. Bacon throws another smoke. Before we get in the contact here, this is what the picture looks like right now. Two squads for US circling a fire team. U.S. being I careful. Viper and Imana is like now pushing in from the rear. I would prefer to stack with oh, the Batman goon and sloth! Okay, the sloth Sly turns on Sloth Boy and kills him before he goes down! Oh man, that's a squad lead down for U.S. as Sloth dies. Unfortunate development here. And now Viper's in charge of the element. Blue hat? Command, this is, uh... Wait, that is. Alright, 
Unfortunate for Sloth there. And, uh, that's all, I think, for the militia forces in the north. Revy and Expit still have their, uh, Dishka offset, but they've lost the entirety of their squad. And the uh, Dishka looks like it's going to try to rejoin the main defense here around Desna. U.S. forces are pushing in slowly but surely. With the forces in the north taken care of, you can bet that U.S. are going to start making inroads towards Desna. 13 kills for U.S., 4 kills for Mill. U.S. doing a good job of supporting fire and engaging some engaging enemy elements with multiple wow, we lost those. Element, or, oh, you, elements, elements, elements. I'm using that word too much. Looks like the convoy um, where am I hearing that from? Oh, that. The MRAP started to move up a little bit. The MRAP, uh, living life on the edge of the road here. Do he mean that and yeah. Zaki might have spotted... Or maybe this is just suppression here. Is gonna go have ahead and have his squad cross the river next to the MRAP. With the suppression of the uh, this open top here, this is a pretty high percentage play that keeps Karma's element alive. Let's see how many of these guys made it across. Looks like. Six now making the cr uh, cross. Actually, it's just five right here. I can count. And Nihol is the last behind. All right, so where's the MRAP going to go now? Militia, holy... Just pulling back, two squads, really just about two, two and a half squads maybe defending Desna right now. Probably more in the order of two squads, with two squads now getting ready to push in. We have only like four map left, four food map left. Okay, keep it in burst. Yeah, I, I know, I'm trying to finish up, I'm always like, okay. We're getting and U.S. moving out. Moving out south for the first time in a while. Militia's falling back from the top here, but I guarantee you they got a sapper watching this. Uh-oh. Salty's buddy just died. So now it's just Salty, and I bet you he's responsible for that uh, IED right here. Let's see if we can find where this guy is planted. Find this ID real quick. <laughs> it's in front of me. It's somewhere right in front of me. Right in this bunch of uh, grass here. And infantry are coming up. A rocket is shot out. Uh oh. Some very long range shots here hit Dark Lord. But the rocket looks like it killed three on US. Lots of fire still going on. Another rocket shot. That one didn't appear to have much of an effect. I can give you a. I can be rest. I can be. I can be pretty sure that Bartok's got the rocket here. 
Let's see how many, but he get, Bartok's got four kills right now. And I think he's loaded another frag. He's looking for more to shoot. The MRAP almost hits the mine. Uh oh, it's US squad lead. Now, are they going to blow this IED for the squad lead here? Are they going to wait for these guys to push off? Remember, the IED is somewhere over here. It's actually in front of me, so it's probably in this bush. It's a little far right now. Mighty's a little far away from it. Not quite the killing range. I think they're going to wait for more infantry to push over here before this IED gets blown. If the sapper's still alive for it. And Xbit and Revy think about attacking from the north, but they get pushed away. Or maybe they're finding a better position. From our position. Kilo 9 is looking for mines, but the IED goes off. Doesn't appear to be uh, any casualties from that IED. Carl goes off and... Uh, not sure if that was anything effective there. So Kilo Kilo 9 is just YOLOing road security here for this MRAP. <clears throat> they get real close. Now there's gonna be there's a mine after this uh, roadblock right here, but this roadblock is still here. Oh, the MRAP! The Dishka... x and Revy just right, roll down the road. No and that's the Dishka technical down. I'm surprised they didn't try to uh, Sorry for that. milk that a little bit more. They knew the technical was north, but I wonder what the idea was. I, they, there's, they had to have known the convoy was up here since they got to about here. But they just rolled that thing straight in. Oof. That could have been a... I mean, I would say that could have been a much higher percentage play there for Militia, but... I don't know if that was... Ooh, Silas gets destroyed by Silent. Silas was crossing in the open. And Silent just on the prowl, looking for kills. And nothing. There's a tree in the way. The point of the convoy still holding position. Hey, Kilo Nine, can you, can you use your bino to scan some? Can you can you use your bino to scan ahead? Now, Dick's folk is still on this ridge line. He's keeping his head down. Militia Command is moving. He's way on out there. He's on the east side of the river. I think they tried to shoot a Dixvolt there. Dixvolt moving a Oh no, maybe that was Raptor Force dying. Hawk survives, but Raptor Force is dead. U.S. forces getting real close. One squad pushing further out to the west, but the main thrust of the advance 
was once infantry, and now it's really this cro is this uh, open top MRAP. Going southwest across the road, get around D10 And I think it's just Bartok is the only uh, lat capability, and I don't see him alive anymore. We're I think militia have already, lost think. all of their uh -huh. lat capability. I'm watching. Keep watching in front. It is now U.S.'s operation to lose. And by lose, I mean throw it away into a mine. Karma running straight at Ronan. Karma squad. Ronan is up here by himself, so if he gets spotted... He's probably done for. Let's take a look at Ronan's yeah, position here. And as a matter of fact, Ronan looks like he's peeked himself quality. back down. Here we go. A little bit of uh, inconsequential uh, right house clearing. Right side clear. And this is house still house a uh, we're good, we're good. important position. Militia could have just been in here shooting for days. Yeah, okay, uh, northwest, because that's what the original clear. contact was. Now they've... They're suspected... Ronan All right. Go slow. is stronger of an element than he is because he's just here by himself. Yeah, wait. Bartok, I got a couple of rocket shots. I got one after the fact, but... Yeah. Oh, brilliant. I know how he stands, okay. Okay, it's the way that he stands on top of the rock rather than the side of the rock. Same here, all does it. We got ammo bags, right? Yeah, the convoy, the tip of the convoy, still holding, in position. Doobie Scoo is running across the river here. Yeah, sure. Oh, well, I don't know, but you can move off if you want. Huh? This element looks like it's moving to go across the river. Maybe they're going to catch up with Blackbeard and try a little right. attempt to uh, cross maneuver here. Convoy moving up. This MRAP is getting really close to some hills, so he's appropriately uh, paranoid. I think I heard Clay uh, shooting. No. U.S. forces moving in. Negative, I think the squad in the west right. takes some contact here from K9 and Scrubius. Scrubius trying to get away. Let's pop some smoke. Evan getting his forces ready for a large-scale push into Desna. Taking a look at the general state of things. Three and one. One is here, and looks like Ronan has his squad turned towards Karma's element. Distraction and barn. I wonder how that's gonna appear. Ronan's just been chilling in this location for like 10 minutes. Ooh. I say that I look away. I think Ronan is taking some shots at a window. Everyone's shooting out of windows. And now they're receiving some fire from Ronan's element. Some of these bullets are actually making their way through. You can see they're hitting the backstop of that wall. Come in, let's just put it hose behind so you. Right here. Right. Yep, yep, yep. I'm a boxer, boys. 
Death, you see his boot right where Karma's standing that wall right there, the eastern wall. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah. Karma's head was in between like those. Us. Yeah. <laughs> they didn't like us. Just putting it mildly. The Crow Zimrap now joining in the siege of Desna. What's going on down here? Yep, yep. Scanning, scanning. Smoke's going off and infantry clearing a roadblock. The first roadblock cleared today. I see no Looks like it'll be cleared unopposed. Wow! The 20 million IQ play. Blackbeard and Dubisku have gone back for the technical. Reloading, guys. This is desperate moves right here. All they gotta do is just roll up behind the convoy and blast the vehicles, and then I guess they can fall back to the Alamo? I don't know, but. It'll be a moral loss for U.S. forces if they lost all of their, uh, vehicles. And... Did you get the mine? Yep. Get the mine gone. Get off the road. Get off the road if you guys are it And that's it. One roadblock is down. Blackbeard and Dubisco have made it to the technical. The technical is rolling. But I think it might have some tires. <laughs> Uh, uh, so, how much longer will this technical roll up before it decides it wants to just destroy some vehicles? <laughs> what is going on? Uncle Niner turns around. And here goes one Dishka and Blackbeard is shot out of the gunner and Dubisku is shot out of the driver's seat. We got contacts across the river. Well, you know, that's one less uh, Lodgy for the, that's one less Lodgy for the U.S. forces now. Also, I think Evan just put a magazine into his foregrip there. Good to know. With the first roadblock done, the convoy rolls into the town. U.S. forces making real big strides here. A lot of militia down. 11 kills for Mill, but 27 for U.S. U.S. forces now even taking the hillside next to Desna. This is going to be like a three-pronged push across the road and from the east and the west. A little bit of opportunity for some uh, rounds to go over, so crossfire is going to be something... What? Oh, the... Uh, the Lodgy blew up. That's what happened. Okay. All right, Scott, when you that so it's just these guys here in Desna now, and someone else I think just went down. Looks like we're down to Clay J, Fight Milk, Nuclear Twister, Salty Potato, Dark Lord here in Desna. Wow, Dick's Falk has actually held his position so long. Dixfolk getting shot at by Sky the Wolf, not able to find the depression he needs to get on the target here. Dixfolk is, I think, trolling for kills here. <gasps> oh, they think he's across the river! Can you give me grid location on that? They think Dixfolk's across the river. Six folk could get some kills here if these guys just YOLO across. No, that's not happening. Evan's taking zero chances. But will Dix Folk turn around to see Merrick and the Harv run? Will he turn around? Oh, I think the Harv 
Yep, nope, the harp didn't see him. Harv and Merrick are clearing these sheds. And Dixvolk is just chilling. Yeah, I can take that up, door. He sees the convoy itself. I wonder if he knows these guys are here. He must, because he's hiding in this... He's hiding here. Green building in Desna has contact. To scrap... Desna defenders down to five. Commands... Oh, these guys are over here. Scrubius and Canine made it out. Oh, Dix is gonna. What's Dix gonna do? He's moving in the open. The guy on top of the ridge line isn't there anymore. What was that? Another explosion? Oh, they used an the engineer charge to blow up the uh, the wall, even though there's squad one still a couple of parts of the wall here that they're going to have to clear out. And squad four, start pushing in. And Evan closing, here in a sec, unfortunately. closing any escape for these forces here in Desna. To watch those contacts across the river. Get your Delta team to push south. Copy. Taking a look at these positions here. It don't look good for Mill. And what is Scrubius and K9 going to do? MRAP taking some shots. And everybody's shooting. I think some more casualties just happened. Three, Fight milk's in the open. Imanaz is running up on Fight Milk. Fight, Imanaz is going to see Fight Milk. Fight Milk gets hit. Grenade gets thrown. Goes off behind Nuclear Twister and he's hit. And then he gets shot in the face. SKS from Dark Lord. Dark Lord loses his buddy. The goon and Demon Einstein might be running up on uh, Dark Lord. Dark Lord continue to crawl. I think. I wonder if the goon saw that. Dark Lord getting shot from far. Oh, maybe he doesn't see. And Dark Lord looks like he gets into the building. Roger. Fight milk is still up. Shots ringing out over top, so Muff goes down to the goon, I think. And fight milk dies. Or maybe that was Dark Lord. Dark Lord may have gotten Muff. Not the goon, because that would have been a team kill. That would have been bad. Even Oz probably saw. Dark Lord here. We haven't taken any recently, no. Okay, mighty. Watch out. They're contact and Delta. Gonna be ending very soon, I imagine. Across the river where you're at. Watch south. Scrubius and K9 are gonna start making it across the river to try to join the defense here, but I think the Kumquat and Matical might have their number. Enemies in here. Enemies in here. Goon, here's Dark Lord. And. Dark Lord gets killed through the window okay. by um, demon. Clay J kills Dwarf. Uncle Niner. Oh, what a shot! Clay J destroys Uncle Niner in the face, and all he, all that's visible is his face. And here we go, Clay by himself. Maybe just leave a buddy team to watch your six. Mm -hmm. 
Dr. Canine and Scrubbish looks like they made it across the river all right, though. I think they're getting shot at by that di by the uh, MRAP, though, so... Uh, they're smoking the river, it sounds like, to our north, northwest here. We're moving to... Oh, they smoked the river? Why? Well, they gave themselves up, so it's just Viper and the MRAP. The MRAP's just gonna go for him, I guess. K9 is gonna try to run out. He gets to the field, Scrubby is following suit. Gets to the other side of the road. So I guess they're gonna move up and try to secure that, uh... Oh, look at this. The, uh, the... Crow MRAP... The Crow's MRAP is literally covering... <laughs> Clay J's front door. Here comes a buddy team to push in. Karma Cut and Modern Death okay, running along. Those buildings are coming up on heavy right now. Yeah. Yeah. Contact yeah. my green building. All right, let's see how long Clay J survives. I'm getting a frag in the green building. Uh, frag in the green building. So uh, I think Clay's dead. Kill stolen by Modern Death. Uh, I got one in here. Line. I got one in here. In yeah. In oh, Dick's full. That's funny. Dick's Folk made it back. Alright, so that's everyone in Desna clear. So now it's down to Scrubius and Dr. K9. And the, uh... The MRAP just rolling around, doing its thing. Oh man, if the, if the MRAP makes it to the top of the hill here... Will it get to the top of the hill? This roadblock is awfully suspicious. Tell us more, Manacle. Oh, look at this. If Manacle has the... Oh, look, there's a sandbag right here. Now it's just down to Scrubius and Dr. K9. What's your ammo? We're, we're gonna go slow and uh, we only have one block. Where's our squad three? You can start pushing up. We have three white. Three. Squad two, you can get north across. The road. And here comes all the U.S. forces coming towards. I think these guys are actually trying to run away. I feel like there's someone behind the sandbag. Yeah, we're just getting up here and then we're gonna U.S. forces well, like, slowly proceeding along. I mean, to to That's a little too risky. To the force, three and three, <laughs> just pushing along this road, clearing shit. You there could it? be a guy that pushed through that field too. Yeah, do not Scrubbies and canine are running at the MRAP. Over here. There's definitely more. Yeah, yeah. These guys don't know. They suspect. I heard They're medical say the there's probably someone building building behind the sandbag. Yeah. All right, two and one, work on uh, clearing that out. Medical might not be long for this world. Although his position right now is... He's probably gonna nade off. I have a combat engineer still up. This is one, we're gonna flank right. Maximizing... Yeah, oh, here comes the grenade. Yeah, go blow it up. Give that guy a good time. A little short. Oh, yeah. Uh, medical, I think, got hit there. K9 and Scrubius with the ultimate Chad move. Ooh, a grenade. Just beyond the MRAP here. And the MRAP's gonna make a retreat. Oh, is Manical now gonna start shooting? Or is Kumquat just lost? I'm about to be hit. I think Medical's actually hit. He's not 
doing anything about it because the screen isn't turning red. Yeah, we're good. So they're going to push straight back up here. Negative, my visuals are uh, very glitchy right now. I think manacles actually hit. Close back like in the field. I think I'm hit. I thought I saw some red pop out there, so. Manacle and Kumquat gonna go away. Gonna check and see if Manacle has to ban. Yeah, Manacle's hit. He's bleeding. And Kumquat gonna take the turret here for a second. K9, not giving up. Uh, there's a charge going off on the roadblock, and that's gonna be a robot clear for US forces. K9 deciding the priority is killing US forces here and not destroying an MRAP. Two, get your guys moving. Infantry move. So is Scrubius gonna shoot now? With the MRAP clear, now is the time. Will Scrubius shoot things? The answer is hopefully. The MRAP is coming back off his position. <laughs> Oof. It's just up to K9, and K9 is going to get run over by Demon Einstein and Imanaz here in a second. K9 is just watching the MRAP. There's nothing he can do. He wants to get a shot on Madigal. Oh, what's going to happen here? Madigal shooting at something. I was just shooting in and the, uh, K9 kills Demon, Madigal finds K9. There we go. 37 kills for US, 20 kills for Mill, and that's GG. A great round. A little bit long, but you know what? Sometimes, sometimes rounds are long. And I do apologize, we did drop connection there during that. Lol. Um, anywho. That was Dark Trail.